So today we are going to be oiling this 25 pound piece of jasper that I found in Minnesota. This bad boy has been sitting in the sun all day, it's still a little lukewarm and I just wanted to show you guys that you can make your rocks look a whole lot better just with the basics. So a little bit of heat from the sun, some mineral oil, and a red. So we're going to make this thing shine. Let me show you some up close details of it before we start making it look real pretty. So this 25 pound piece of jasper. It's pretty worn. That's why I want to put some oil on it to expose some better details. You can see there's some quartz running through it on this side. The edges here, very beautiful. Really excited to see how these deeper reds are going to look. And this back side, it's pretty worn as well. So before I apply the mineral oil to this bad boy and make it look real nice, I'm going to put some tape right down the middle. I'm going to oil half of it and then we can show you the difference between the two halves. Let's get started with that. So now that it's taped up, let's get it oiled up on the right side and then we can compare the right and the left. So now that this is pretty doused in mineral oil, I'm going to take a drier part of the rag and rub it in so that it's not super slick because as, as of right now you can see my finger is pretty oily. That's not what you want from your rock. So let's rub in some of this mineral oil. Alrighty, so I got that mineral oil rubbed in pretty good on here, so what I'm going to do now Take this tape off and we can show you the left compared to the right with the mineral oil rubbed into it. How satisfying is that? <laughs> So here we have totally dry on the left compared to the right side, baked in the day's sunlight with oil rubbed in with a cloth. How amazing does that look? Let's get the rest of this thing oiled up so we can take a closer look at all those amazing details. Now we're gonna take a drier part of the rig and rub that oil in. So as I finish rubbing off the excess oil on this thing, I just wanted to say a lot of people will take their stones, like Lake's Pure Eggs for example, they'll put them in the oven, they'll bake them for a while, and then they'll soak them in mineral oil and they'll get a similar outcome, obviously a lot better. But I just wanted to show a very simple way to make your stone look better. Now this process is very simple, very easy. Like I said, I just baked it in the sun all day long, put oil on it, and now I'm rubbing it off 
I'm going to show you how it looks here in just a second. It looks so much better than before. Alrighty, so oiling this 25 pound piece of Jasper is complete. I'm really excited to show you the details. I just wanted to let you guys know that this process, not including it sitting in the sun all day, only took about 30 minutes. So if you guys want to do this at home, it's super easy, very simple, very minimal supplies. Let me show you those details. Alrighty, so here it is all oiled up. Looks pretty good. It's got some really great fracturing going on in there. Nice quartz running right across the middle really cool piece definitely a lot better with the oil it's still a little slick it's got to set in a little bit more but I love these yellows and these oranges running around it so cool got some really nice yellows going on in here a lot of the red Jasper that I find up on the North Shore has that oolitic pattern so that's really cool to see a yellow oolitic like pattern in there which is really pretty this is really neat too kind of painty but very neat runs along there such a cool piece such a great display piece really great colors in here yeah definitely love this angle though of everything running across right here. This stuff right here is really cool. Love that. I think we should find a home for this. Sorry, brain rock. Well, that is everything we have for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. You can take along on all future adventures. And if you like today's video and you want to see more content like this, leave a thumbs up. We'll see you next time. Bye.